Hi everyone. Um, he's here, so that means it's a food box. Um, it's Universal Yum. This is supposed to be Columbia. Uh, apparently, didn't cut off all the tape in preparation for this video. You were not prepared. I was not prepared. Columbia. Overflowing box. I see lots of packages with stuff to the top. Right. So we might need this. That's our scorecard. Mm -hmm. Yes, cassava strips. It's sea salt. No, I, I've had cassava before, and depending on how it's fixed, I either like it or hate it. So. Not bad though. No, it's not, not bad at all. It's not terrible. I'm gonna give it the me in face. <laughs> what are you gonna give it? Yeah, me. Alright. Next we're gonna go with the risadas? Yes. Risadas, pico chicas. What's that? What's up, potato chips? Spicy potato chips. I think I think all they've given us is We've got so many potato chips. I know like some of our neighbors in the Americas will look at you next to Colombians are sensitive to spicy foods and use hot peppers in their in sauces. Hot peppers and sauces in their cuisine sparingly. This is like apparently this is like as spicy a snack food as you're gonna find in Colombia. Which sad gives me a great day. You'll never get up with some. It's like ruffle chips. Mm -hmm. Just a tiny bit of heat. But it's an, enough yeah. heat that I can feel it in the back of my throat. Mm -hmm. And it's not hot enough that I... I'm just wanting to drink so that my mouth is fresh for the next one. Okay. I'm going to give that one a medium place too. Oh no. Which one is that? Oh, it's not on here. Exactly. Wait. That was the, the chips. Is that a sabo de No, they're not in here. All right. on the no, it's, the, it's something else in the box. Oh, here's another flavor. This is mayonnaise flavored. Uh. Yay! Emily's chips. Yay! 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 I like mayonnaise very light, like on a burger, mm. and like mixed in stuff. No. It's got almost like a mustard flavor to it. No, I can taste the mayonnaise. I could eat those on a burger or something, like on a burger, instead right. of the mayonnaise, but mm. I wouldn't just sit and eat these. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even going to do you want? Well, you guys trash me. Alright. These Goodbye. are plantain chips. Plantain chips, chili flavored. Alright, before we do this, I'm getting mayonnaise taste out of my mouth. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't blame you. Never. We, I, don't think we I had cooked we've, plantains before. But we've never had chips, and we've had banana chips. Plantains are more like potatoes than bananas. Not bad. I don't like them. Columbia's filling me on chips. Normally chips is what I like. Yeah, chips is like your thing. Those on there so I can give them a... Nope. Ugh. 
You're being really salty. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, no. This is. This That's is. That's those. That's the one up there. Yeah, that's the one of those ones. Mm. And those are yuck. What are you giving the man? Yuck. Uh, it's not. It's not horrible, horrible, but it's not great by any stretch of the imagination. What, what's this one? This one's this one. Mm -hmm. Oh, these are bacon chips. Yes. With I'll lime. Have. Bacon chips with lime flavor. There's suckers in there. That one hates me. <laughs> it looks like bacon. It's like a pork pie. You know what that tastes like to me? A bugle. I would really like it if it wasn't lime flavored. Yeah, I'm not getting lime flavored. I am. You know how much I hate the lime. Well, I got a little bit on that one. Ugh. Not bad. It's weird. These aren't on here either. Yeah. What is this one? Oh, that was the plain page. Yeah, that was the Yeah, I already put a duck face on it. I'm going to put a medium face on the plantains. What about you? What do you want to do on the plantains? Um, yeah, medium. We've not had any yums yet. All right. I haven't. And that's unusual. On to the sweets. That's the first day of our kids. This has tin in it. And I think, based on the pink packaging, that it's probably strawberry flavored. Maybe. It's definitely strawberry flavored, so you're gonna hate this. Probably. Ooh, I love it. Mm. It's like strawberry cream. That's a, a slightly different strawberry flavor than what I'm used to getting. Mine. You don't like strawberries. Mine. But the cookie's really good though. In Colombia, the preferred flavor is strawberry. So. That is very good. I like that. I'm not sure that qualifies as a yum, but I'll I, give that a yum because I'm I mean, if it's strawberry, it. that can make me like strawberry. Here's a Bianchi mm -hmm. bar. It says Carmelo and Mani. So I'm thinking caramel and nuts. You want to split this one? Because there's two yes. in here. It's chocolate. Yeah, it's white chocolate, but there's something in it. Caramel and something. Mm -hmm. You want the big half or the little half? Give me the little half. The little half is good. Okay. White chocolate, caramel, and peanuts. It's really hard when you had it in the fridge. Yeah, it is though. The kids might not get to taste this this one. Because <laughs> I bet if it wasn't so hard, it would be even better. That is even better. I should have taken the big pack. I offered. I have a great fear of weird food. <laughs> I'm giving that one a yum. Mm -hmm. This is something Nestle. Coco Cell? I bet there's some kind of wafer cookie. It is, I can tell. Just by feeling on the... Yep. See, if you feel it, feel. Yep. Feel through the package, you can feel the wafer mm -hmm. cookie. And it's it's like two wafer, two wafer cookies, so we'll split one. It's just this is vanilla wafers with a filling made with roasted coconut and chocolate. They're brown. I don't know how that's the vanilla ones we have here are white. Mm. 
Is it okay? You get the coconut flavor. It's okay, but I don't really like it. Kinda likes all those flavors. I just don't really I mean, it's okay. Yeah. It's not bad. It's not ridiculously awesome, but it is good. I'm just gonna give it a medium face. It didn't blow me away. What do you wanna give it? What's your score? Okay. All right. We will. <laughs> We're gonna try everything. Chocolate. Everything that's outside of that first. I think this is a brownie. It's a chocolate vanilla. Wait, it's a vanilla cake with chocolate flavored coating. Jesus, this thing is huge. I'm just gonna. Whoa. I don't think you're gonna like that. It's got a weird flavor to it. It's a lemon pancake. But I like that. Coated in chocolate. It was delicious. This is vanilla cake. It says vanilla cake with chocolate flavored coating. It says right here lemon. I don't like it. A light lemon pancake coated in a thin layer of rich milk chocolate. I, it's not yucky, but. Um. We have such varying tastes. We'll I have a far broader taste spectrum than you do. Is there, is there stuff, any of this stuff we got sitting out that you want? Because if you do, we'll I'm not hit on anything yet, but I'm just desperate to finish the bio like okay. I have on some of these. Well, I'm going to start putting these back up to the chest. I mean, that was... It would appear that Columbia is shaping up to have some pretty bland food. It's not bland. It's not the bland for me. It's just I don't like most of it. Weird, gross. I'm hoping next month is better. <laughs> yeah. Got a cat in there ransacking the kitchen. All right. What is this? That's some kind of dulce de leche. It's lactose free. How do we eat it with a spoon? I'm looking. Do we drink it? Do we dip something in it? Mm. I think you should just do it. grab a spoon and start smacking. So I'm not big on dulce de leche. <laughs> I'm gonna try a little bit. Caramel. Yeah, that's. That's what it is. Yeah. I love it. Oh, yeah. This is going in the fridge. <laughs> I'll eat that as a snack for me. It's good on ice cream. I might don't have ice cream. So I might have ice cream. Do I got vanilla ice cream? Or what? what? Well, said the is very good. Are you going to yum or yeah? Yum. It's, it's really good. It's just not my thing. Oh, by the way, that's what this thing looks like. I didn't even show you. you tiny. They're tiny. It's very full, though. It's I'm like, not telling you what that is until you open it. Can you at least say it for the camera? Mm -hmm. uh, that cast, is... cast a pan. Cast a pawn. Yeah. Cast a pawn. I normally don't read the book mm -hmm. until after I've tried the stuff because I don't trust myself. <laughs> oh, it stinks. Try your little nibble of it. I'll tell you what it is. Something with spices in it. This is a very common combination in Colombia, apparently. I've never heard of this stuff before. Is it bugs? No, it's not bugs. It's, it's nothing it's nothing weird or gross. It's just I've never heard of this combination of that stuff before. Is it goat? No, it's not goat. I don't think. It smells weird. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. It's it's tough too. It's, is it from where we have it in the fridge? No. You're gonna start going, mm, mm, oh, it feels rubbery, like that slimy cake last time. It's like blood orange or something. It's guava paste. I don't even know what that is. 
All yours. Bocadilla is it's like some kind of guava paste. It's and apparently I'm very confused because their recommendation is to try this with like a piece of string cheese or mozzarella. Because that's like a thing. Cheese. I'll try that later. Because I like fruit here's and cheese. The, here's the weird thing. I got a really weird taste at the beginning, but I got an interesting aftertaste at the end. Try a big bite of middle then. If you like that, we'll go get a piece of string cheese when we're done with this. We'll try it like that and see how it is. Because I like fruit and cheese. What's on the side? Same stuff, just different color. See, I misread it. I actually thought it had cheese with it in the bar. It's so weird. Weird, can't, weird doesn't have to be bad. It has a weird beginning, but this interesting aftertaste. It's, it's guava. weird. What's the stuff on the side? Is the sugar on the side? It's, it's all just guava paste. No, there's sparkly stuff on it. different color. It's got sparkly stuff in it all over. It's full of sugar. Okay. It's just two different colors of guava paste to make their little I don't know about that. Bar. I'm going to have to think on that. <laughs> Super Cocoa. Is you a super cocoa? Coffee delight candy. Super this cocoa is? candy. Oh, wait. Nut based nougat. It smells funny. Everything smells funny. Well, you know, their stuff is different than, like, their cocoa will be different than ours. Their, it's going to be different. I don't really like it. It's weird. Like, not weird like interesting weird, but weird as in burnt sugar weird. It's burnt sugary peanut in here. Okay. I'm not a big fan of that either. This must be the coffee one. This is what the super cocoa looks like, by the way. They send you lots of these little candies to try. I don't know why, because a lot of times you try one you don't want anymore. Then we got coffee delight. I like coffee. Let me get the burnt sugar taste in my mouth. Get those. Hmm. Please don't ruin the coffee for me. Colombian coffee. It's probably gonna be really dark. Hmm. I don't really like dark roast coffee. It does not smell like coffee. Oh my god. That is so... Is it intense? That is like instant coffee. Suck on it for a few seconds. And it's like instant coffee out of the jar. That is the coffee out of an MRE. I kid you not. <laughs> this is like a little tablet of the coffee that comes in MREs. The little chocolate syrup on it's going to taste just like Ranger pudding. Alright. Colombian coffee. I told you, Colombian coffee is dark. It's heavy. I drink whippy coffee. It's cappuccinos. I make prison coffee. You try to stir it. It grabs the spoon and smacks you with it. That's, you can't make that in our coffee pot. I know. Ours is a pure egg. When, when I make coffee at work, people are afraid to drink it. Alright, I am going to finish this piece of candy, but since it's a hard candy, I'm going to set it to the side for now. Okay, I also need to, let's see. Yucky, yucky, yucky green things. What do you think about the green things? The, the no, I don't like that at all. There was the other yucky. They tasted like peanut brittle that you thrown in a fire. And the fire didn't kill it, so you decided to eat it. <clears throat> My pen doesn't want to write anymore. I'm going to give that a yeah, not a yum on the coffee candy. I'm going to give the coffee a yum, because I like that. All right. Now we have lollipops. We have mango. And ooh. passion fruit. 
Have we got anything else that we just eat? It's not hard candy. This is just it. This, this is, is the, the last, last thing. thing. Okay. 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 It looks like they got stuff so in the bed. This is what it looks like. This is what the sucker looks like, and I'm pretty sure it has seeds in it. That is so gross. All yours. All right. Mm. Ooh, crazy. Mango. I don't like passion fruit. It's good. It's really good. Well, I didn't find out what the black things are. No, I like it. And this is. It's a good thing it's him, and I can just suck on him and hand it to him, and he can taste it. Mm -hmm. I like it. He likes like the mango. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm debating. <laughs> I don't think I like it either. I'm always weirded out by mango. Because I, I, I think it's orange flavored, but it's not really like orange or citrusy or tangerine or anything like that. So I'm getting a very bright citrus flavor from the passion fruit. Yeah. I don't like the suckers. Mm -mm. The mango. I can tolerate the mango more than I can that, but I don't want it. I will keep the passion fruit sucker. The kids are gonna gag. They'll probably want to cut so they'll probably want to cut the water to rinse it off. That way <laughs> they don't have germs from the other kid on it. <laughs> I don't know about these coffee candy. We ain't got enough for the kids to try. Oh man. I was gonna keep them. <laughs> Not that I like them, just that it feels like it's the same thing. All right. Book. Find out where we're going next Zip. month. Clue to next month's box. You've heard this place on the news, but keep an open mind. It's our first time going here, and who knows what we will find. Malaysia flavored chips. Cumin mm. cookies. Just know that you'll want more. It's a whole new world of youngs next month in the land of the pure. Um, that's not Malaysia, I don't think. Well, no. Masala. You've heard this place on the news, mm -hmm. but keep an open mind. No. It's our first time going here, and who knows what we will find. Malaysia flavored chips. Masala. Cumin cookies. Just know that you'll want more. It's a whole new world of yum next month in the land of pure. Masala and cumin. Let me think India. Oh, it's masala flavored? I said, uh, you I said Malaysia. Said Malaysia. Twice. I thought you were saying. No, I'm saying masala. So it's making you think where? It's somewhere. It's either. It might be Pakistan. But I'm thinking more India with masala and cumin. I think they've done an India box before. I don't know because we're fairly I'm new sure. subscribers. I'm trying to think of what, what place calls itself Land of the Pure. Pakistan. Pakistan, okay. So, so Pakistan. Pakistan next month. I wonder if their stuff's going to be all spicy. Are they spicy there? Pakistan is... I won't go on too long. I won't make this video 15 more, 20 minutes, however much, however longer. Pakistan is a fragment of India that the British split off to separate the Muslim majority from the rest of the I want to know Muslim if they make Indian spicy Indian. food. Indian food is spicy. Pakistani food is very spicy. So we might get some, some good you know, tikka masala chips and maybe some curry flavored things. Alright, so what do you want to, to rate your suckers? Um, we're going to go to the middle rating on that just because one of them is horrible and the other one is delicious. Oh, what do you rate this weird little thing? Um, that guava eating thing. One. We didn't have anything that was just delicious from Columbia. Uh, no, you, we, you said the, 
the cake. Well, yeah. And these this strawberry things. It's very good. You said the strawberry things? You said this little candy okay. bar? Well, I'm, I'm looking at it weird. But no chips this time. I mean, <laughs> chips were my thing. In every box we've had, there's been like a bag or two of chips that I'm just selling. Not if I swear, I found the little cakes on Amazon, but they're so pricey. I've not found the weird little bugles. And I would like those. It's like a, they were like sweet onion, right? I'll have to watch my own video. Find yeah, out. Alright, that is it for this video. Um, should have a couple more, I think, before the month's out. If you'll Phantom of the Month. And Nerd Block is no longer, so I don't know. I will get my Doctor Who block. Everybody else got except me. Alright, so if you have any comments, questions, anything like that, put them below and I'll get to them as soon as I see them. Thanks!